Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Jerry Views back with another video and today we're talking about two iOS updates even though these two updates are month apart from each other. So we're talking about iOS 18.2.1. We have some news about that and of course we have some great news regarding the new iOS 19 which of course will go on beta in June and then will be released to the public in September 2025. So first of all, let's talk about iOS 18.2.1 which is an update that it should be out very very soon now currently that has been spotted by mac rumors that is an update that is confirmed that is coming out and it should come out because ios 18.2 actually has quite a lot of bugs and i have noticed some here on my device especially the screen not responding as it should and sometimes the apps basically having quite a hard time loading especially here the icons on the settings app they load very hard sometimes and other problems that other users have reported so there will be an ios 18.2.1 that is confirmed but we were expecting actually that to be released very very soon but it looks like we will have to wait for a few more days so here we have the feedback app and if you have this app you go here you will have your inbox where you get basically news from apple now this is the winter break for apple and according to them they will be back in the office on january the 2nd that means that we won't get ios 18.2.1 this year that will happen in january 2025 and we will have to see which date that will be so if they will be on the second back in the office that would be a thursday most likely they won't release the update on day one because if they had it already ready for release they would have released it before so most likely the 6th or the 7th of january will be the dates when we get the new ios 18.2 point one release to the public and even though this will be a very small update it will contain some really important fixes all these bugs that we get on ios 18.2 and of course there will be also security patches which happen in the background that we don't even notice so this is even though again a small update a really important update for ios users and now let's talk about iOS 19 and we have a great news here when it comes to this new software update. Well, this great news also might mean that it's not that great when it comes out. So you can see right here, these are devices that will be supported by iOS 19. And as you can see by the list here, every device that is currently supported on ios 18 will also be supported on ios 19. now that's great news of course more people will be able to update their device to the newest software but that means that most likely ios 19 won't have any like significant changes or any like big new features because if that would have happened then apple would have to actually just cut off some of the older devices but that's me that means again that it might be a way smaller update than ios 18. so that's basically it for this video guys hope you guys enjoyed the video smash that like button if you did and of course don't forget to subscribe for more videos and more news regarding new ios releases and i will see you on the next one